Hey guys, what's up? So we're going to be looking at some people who had one job and absolutely failed at that one job. So I haven't did one of these reaction videos in a while, so we're just going to do some today. Okay, what is this? Kids drinks? Those do not look like kids drinks to me. Target, I am talking to you, Target. The question is, why do they put these kinds of beverages in the kids drinks aisle? When you, It's like you want kids to drink these. They secretly want you to suffer. <sighs> Obviously, you had one job. This is what happens when you let a five-year-old do this. It's what happens if you let. It's what happens if you let a five-year-old do your job. They're obviously gonna go like, "Hey, no, I want to do the lines." Next time, I think you better do it yourself, and not trust some five-year-old to do things for you. So at this store, we got a pair of long yellow things. Yes, that are definitely that is definitely long yellow things. If only they had a name. Yes, I do know the name, guys. They're bananas. Like, what? Did you not eat a banana when you were a kid? Hmm. They're long. They're yellow, but I do not know what the name is. We'll just call them long yellow things. We're not just going to say, Hey, Google, search me what those long yellow things are. It's like, this person does not know what Google search is. Alright. There is a hole right here where you're supposed to put the, this portion, but why is it right there and not here? There's a hole that tells you to, where to put it. This makes me angry on a whole nother level. Like, the hole's right there. And you're not just going to assume that that's where it's that's supposed to go? I don't know. Okay. Who would sit at this bench? Why is the bench not the right way? The bench is facing the wall. How are people supposed to sit in the bench if nobody could sit there? Yeah, I don't... I don't think you're going to keep your job for much longer, sir. You're going to get... Someone's going to get fired real quick. Yes, that is definitely... Alright, so this person just put emergency bell. Yes, that is definitely an emergency bell. I could just press it and the alarm would go off and I could prank the fire department. Don't do that in real life. But no, that's not an emergency bell. That's literally a doorknob. You know, before Ring was invented where you could just get a security cam on your phone. That's doorbells. That's what doorbells had a purpose for until you could until you could see who's trying to break in through the door. But no, that's only an emergency bell. I'm not even gonna school you on this one, but I do know that is literally not an emergency bell. Who designed this? Who designed these stairs? The the handle is pointing. It's it's put on the wrong way. How? This is just very awful. I do not want to go to this place. Just shut down this store. You have very stupid employees who do not know how to put the this on right. All right, this is just awful. So the key, the keyboard on this Windows 10 computer, just like when my operating system is running, I know that's Windows 10. Just look at the logo. But the problem is, both the keyboard and the mouse is on the wrong area. The mouse is where the keyboard is supposed to be, and the keyboard is where the mouse is supposed to be. Come on, no, that just, that looks awful. Come on. I would not buy this. This just confuses me on an entire whole new level. <laughs> what kind of website is this? Okay, so this website, there's a country, and you select one, but this this is interesting option where Chipotle is the is a country. No, what I wonder what kind of universe or galaxy has a Chipotle as a country. 
Everybody knows that in this universe, the Milky Way universe, that Chipotle is a restaurant and not a country. And I know that because I read a map. Why does this website exist? I do not know. I'm not even going to use that as an option. Um, I wonder what you're keeping in this garage. This person had one job. Put the garage on the right floor. Why do you need a garage on the second floor? Wait, is this for Ego it's supposed to be, you know, where Fortnite in Chapter 2, Season 2, where, every, where a lot of people have chosen? But the team I have chosen in Fortnite, before I stop playing. But, you know, I don't really play much anymore. It's not it's still banned on iOS, guys. And by the way, guys, I am producing a brand new miniseries called The App Store's Rules. If you guys want to watch it, I'm going to air it in prime time, which will take over the time slot where Social Media Devices' final season takes place. But, you know, why Why do you need a garage on the second floor? Wait, is this where the, ch the choppa is at? Is this where Ego is going to be? I do not know. Just why. This is just so extra. This is just a, this just offends me because I play Minecraft. Everybody knows if you guys play Minecraft, smash like if you guys play Minecraft. I I'm producing season five right now, but everybody knows that this mob is a creeper, and these two look normal. But this creeper, unfortunately, a 1.17 glitch or something, that the face is upside down, and it's not even dinner bone like. Everybody knows if you put if you put dinner bone on a name tag and you name the mob that it will just go upside down. Similar if you name a mob or a sheep Jeb underscore, which is Jeb's username, it'll turn into a disco sheep. I know that I have one of those. But why is the creeper's head upside down? It does not look creepy to me. It's supposed to I don't know, this is not the creeper I know and love. The creeper I have now, which I got for my birthday, I posted it on my Instagram, Michael's Job with Nine. You guys can totally check that out. <sighs> the amount of stupidity the stop sign gives me. Why is the stop sign green? Green does not signal stop, it signals go. Why does this why is the stop sign green? It's like you want people to like not follow it. They secretly want you to break the rules. Remember the song, Break the Rules? It's kind of a song. I don't know the artist completely, but do you know the song I listened to it back in fourth grade? It's a little negative, and I think the song has the F word in it. But why is the stop sign green? Why? Everybody knows stop means red. Don't you know the song that I've learned in preschool or elementary school? I don't remember where I learned it from, but I do know it's from there. I know the song, guys. Red means stop. Green means go. Yellow means slow down. But why is it green? Like, it signals... It does not signal stop. Just throw away this entire stop sign or paint it red. Oh, no. This fool... Flying insect killer and in the exact same color and can as canola cooking spray. And it's actually the exact same company too. This is not this is not a good idea. This is a this is a this is a lawsuit in a can all in one. Someone's gonna get sued like really quick. Oh my goodness, this is for my fish if I had one. Are you tired of your fish not being able to call you? Well now there's a phone that floats on water. Literally floats on water. Um, uh, is that floating? I do not see any floating here. It just things at the bottom. Like phones are now. Gravity all in one. I had to catch my phone because I do not trust myself dropping it on the ground. I almost broke my phone trying that. It was an accident. I was watching Clear TV and I, I literally almost damaged my phone completely. I'm lucky it's repaired now. Like, that would have been awful. McDonald's, you had one job. 
We got a little ice right here, and obviously it's McDonald's because I can see the M. Smash that like, smash the like button if you see M. And comment below if you don't. <laughs> but no, the is this ice? Nope, that is literally not ice. That's popcorn. Popcorn. Ice and popcorn are two different kinds of items. Popcorn has butter in it, unless you chose the butter-free popcorn. Ice is basically hard water. McDonald's, you had one job. This is clickbait. This is false advertising. I want my money back. Ah, uh, yeah. Sorry, guys. So we got Red Shoe Barn, where we got rubber. <laughs> Sorry, I can't say the word because it's going to be family friendly. But just pretend it's, we're going to say it's women's private parts. Red Shoe Barn, we got rubber private parts. For family friendly content, I can't say what the parts are. Sorry, we're going to keep the channel as family friendly while also in more teens. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Who gave Pooh Bear teeth? The reason why he eats honey is because he has no teeth. Otherwise, he'd be eating like human flesh. Just throw away this entire idea. No, Pooh Bear does not need to have teeth. No. Alright guys, but anyways, that's all for today. If you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that like button in the face and subscribe to my channel. I love you guys. I am Michael Stalwolf. Content you will enjoy.